Hey Penna Pinchers, welcome back to my channel. I hope everyone's having an amazing day. This is your glamorous Penny Pincher Shalomi and today I'm coming to you with some amazing ways to style your entryway table. If you want to see the different looks I've put together for you, then just keep on watching. And here is the first look for you. It's important to note that all the pieces that I'll be using in these looks for you that I already have them. I'm just basically shopping my home and just repositioning stuff to bring you these looks. In the center here, I have this tray. I've had this for a while. And what I did was I just added some items to it. First, you'll see this vase that I DIY'd. I've also added these uh, two beautiful candlesticks that I picked up at HomeSense a while back. And then in the center, I have my tall jar that I also picked up at HomeSense. And I've also had this one for a very long time. I've used it in so many different places in my home and it just looks absolutely great wherever I use it. And on both sides of the tray, I just have these beautiful jars that I picked up at um, Burlington. Again, I picked them up sometime last year before Christmas. I believe that was my last trip to Buffalo before the whole coronavirus hit and spoiled all my plans. For this look, I did some changes to the centerpiece. As you can see on the ends, I kept uh, the apothecary jars and have just placed them on a silver plate. And then in the center, I did some changes. I kept the jar that was already there, but then I added these beautiful silver pineapples that I've had for quite a while. And then I just added this uh, sphere or this ball that matches my tray. Now this is very harsh, very silver, has no color at all. And so I'm going to do a little touch of green to it to kind of soften it a little bit. I absolutely love these silver pineapples. I've had them for quite a while. And they are absolutely beautiful and very, very elegant. Okay, so I am back with just the touch of green to kind of lively up the space and to break up all the uh, silver that I had before and it just basically adds a different touch so guys don't be afraid to experiment move stuff around try it if it doesn't look right try something else the idea is to create the look that you want in your home This next look is just to create a little bit of island feel and fun. I have added palm leaves that you have seen in my most recent tablescape. I also added the palm trees. They're actually candle holders, but I didn't put candles in them this time. And on the end, I have pineapples. I've had these pineapples for forever. 
during my pineapple craze days and I have just covered them with um, these DIY cloches that I did. I believe I did them sometime last year. So again, guys, I'm just showing you how you can just move things around in your home, uh, try them out, see what happens, see if you like it or not. If not, just change it around. But always shop your home first before considering buying anything. Because trust me, a lot of the things that you need or you want to use to decorate your home, you probably already have it stashed somewhere. For this look, I decided to go with a crystal and gold look, that's what I'm calling it, where I have incorporated a lot of glass, a lot of crystals with gold. Here in the center, I have my golden tiara tray. You have seen it in many of my videos. And this beautiful pineapple here with the amazingly beautiful crown. I'm using as my centerpiece and then I have covered it with this DIY cloche. On the side of that I'm using this beautiful lantern and again inside I went in with kind of like the glass and gold or the crystal and gold with the candlestick and then I have a tiny pineapple sitting on top of that. And then on the other side, I went in with these old gold candles that I've had for a while and these beautiful crystal candlesticks. And these are candlesticks that I thrifted years ago. They are super heavy and they are so beautiful. Um, I thrifted them, I think I paid $20 for all three. They're super heavy and they are gorgeous. So this is just another look that I wanted to share with you guys where I just pick stuff up from around the house and just decided to create some looks for you. I hope you're finding them inspiring and that you're getting ideas to create your own looks for your home. While some of us are still quarantined and places have either reopened but they don't have a lot of items or they're still closed and you're trying to find items to kind of redecorate. Okay guys, this one is a little over the top, but you know me, I have to try everything. So um, I have used my tray from my coffee table it's a huge tray and inside of it i have my um, diy uh, ginger jar that i did with these beautiful flowers cherry blossoms and some other beautiful ones that i picked up from the dollarama using it as a centerpiece and I've also added this little um, pheasant from my set of the peacock and the pheasant as my centerpiece. And on this side, I have these two beautiful candle holders. I've had these for a while as well. They're kind of like a honeycomb design. Two beautiful white barrel candles in them. And on the other side, I'm using again my lantern, and this time I have just replaced the pineapple with a candle.
Here's another look, guys. I just kind of mimicked what I have going on in my living room and just used the lantern and this beautiful vase with the pink and white accent flowers. I just moved them over here to create this centerpiece in this gold and white tray. On the end here, I've just incorporated some white candle stands. Very, very heavy. And I kept the honeycomb candle holders on the other end. And that is all I have for you today, guys. Thank you so much for joining me. I truly do appreciate you coming by. And if this is your first time seeing my channel, welcome, welcome, welcome. I would love for you to join the Penny Pincher family by hitting the subscribe button below. And don't you forget that notification bell. Hit that also. That way you are the first to know when I upload videos such as this. And to all my lovely Penny Pinchers, you know how I feel. Love you, love you, love you. Until the next video, this is your glamorous Penny Pincher Shalomi saying bye-bye. <laughs>